Hey, Jen Soto here, and I want to show you um, one of my favorite seasonings that we have, our guacamole dip. So have you ever wanted to make guacamole, but you're like, I don't have all the ingredients. This is going to make it so easy for you. So you just want to take your avocados. You want them to be um, ripe. As a matter of fact, the way you know that they're ripe is you want them to be a little soft, not too soft. And then you just take this little nubby right here off. And if it comes off, and it's brown underneath, then you know that they're ready. Then you're gonna take our avocado tool. This tool is kind of an all-in-one tool to prep your avocado, and um, you're just gonna take the little knife side, actually use the soft side right here, and go around the seed, okay? And then open it up, and then you can go through here and just scrape out the inside of your avocado. It's so easy. I'm gonna get that peel off right there. It's so easy. So, um, I love it. Okay, now this is the hard part. This is the part where you might end up in the emergency room and we do not want that. But you're gonna take this end right here. It has some little prongs and you're gonna stab your thing and it comes right out. The seed is so easy to get out with our little avocado tool and you don't have to worry about any emergency room trips. So I'm just going to get some of that extra peel off, drop that in there. All right, so we'll go ahead and do our second and third avocado. I could never have enough guacamole. It's so delicious. And our seasoning mix doesn't need anything added onto it. It's complete. But I will say, I do like tomatoes in my guacamole, so I do add some chopped tomatoes in there. Did you see how easy that is? Your kids could do this. This is a job, if you have small children um, or a husband that you want to give a job in the kitchen, um, you can. they can easily prep the guacamole for you. And then when it comes time to eating it, they can say, I did that and have some excitement over that. All right, twist off this last one. Isn't it funny how you never know if you're gonna get a big seed or a little seed? One thing you can't tell when you're buying your avocados. So, all right, we'll get this last one. This is a nice big seed, but it comes out just the same as the other two with my avocado tool. All right, scrape this in here, get that off. All right, so now the second part of this is easy peasy. We just want to take, so we did three avocados, so we're going to take three tablespoons of the dip and we're going to add that in there. Okay, this beats the heck out of, you know, adding all the other ingredients in here. All right, and we're just going to mash. I'm just using my mix and masher right here to mash this together and then we'll let it sit and it will be all ready to go. You can also use the mix and masher for potatoes or bananas or anything else that you need to mash together and get nice and smooth. It's dishwasher safe, it's a nylon tool, super easy to use. Again, you can get your whole family involved by doing this. Okay, that was pretty easy, wouldn't you say? About five minutes, we've got some delicious guacamole. Mm.